the Antonio project. Hello everybody. So today we will conduct all tests for lifting up layers like the jet block, virus link and nylon link in accordance with International Labor Organization. Article 25 to Convention Number 152. Every lifting appliance shall be tested with a test load which shall exit in the same working load or SWL as well. For SWL test load up to 20 ton, 0 to 20 tons to be load tested with 25% in excess or 125%. And for SWL test load 20 to 50 tons to be load tested with 10% in excess or 110%. Let's go. We will conduct the test. As you can see in the video, this is the tools that we are using for conduct the load test. The tool for load test is crane scale and the maker is caston and the type of the crane scale is caston 2. The capacity of this crane scale is 5 tons. The part are as follow. This is the hook, pin, and safety pin. This one is a spare battery. This is cable for adapter. And next is battery charger for charging the battery. With the input is multi voltage 100 until 240 volt and output is DC 6 volt. And this one is connector for charging the battery to adapter. And this one is main instrument, the crane scale. On the crane scale itself, already attached a battery for the crane scale. Also, instruction manual in the Korean language. And this is the display of the crane scale. And downside is the power button and then on off button. There is zero button and third button also holding button. This crane scale did not equip it with the Bluetooth or wireless display. And for the reading, we are using this display. Other than that, we necessary to use chain block with the SWL 5 ton because the crane scale also 5 ton. So it, it should be equal with the crane scale. And there are two eye plates installed at the workshop with the SWL 7 5 tons. And this is special for load test work. Definition, safe working load or SWL, sometimes stated as T. Normal working load or NWL is the maximum safe. It is a calculation of the minimum breaking strength or MBS, aka minimum breaking load or MBL, divided by a safety factor. Usually ranging from 4 to 6 on lifting equipment, the factor can be as high as 10 per 1 or 10 to 1 if the equipment has possessed a risk to a person's life. Working load limit or WLL which is the maximum working load designed by the manufacturer. This load represents a force that is much less than that required to make the lifting equipment fail or yield. 
In accordance to many source reference, SWL is no longer used to identify the maximum capacity of equipment due to it being too vague and leaving it open for legal issues. The United States and European standard switched to the working load limit standard shortly after. But in some country, the SWL still in use. Next, let's start the load test. So it's considered good condition. Chain block require for two tons require two point five or two thousand five hundred about. So it's considered good condition.
Tron. Portrait Tron. So, for three tons, require 3.75 tons or 3,750 about. For three tons, require about 3,750. So it is okay. Consider good condition. So around 3.75. So, and then for nylon sling bed, as you can see, on the back there is a SWL for working uh, load. When this uh, single single load, so the SWL is. Uh, 1.6 ton when double loop is 3.2 ton and when the other is 1.28 ton so the small one And that for wire is WL written in here. Zero point eight ton of this one. Also same. Zero point eight ton. This one is 3.3 ton. Okay. So for sling wire 0.8, we conduct the load test 1 ton or 1,000 kilo. So for 
this one is 1.6 times 0 and 120. So this one is equal to 2 tons. Thank you for watching my video. If you have any advice, suggestion, or question, please let me know and write on the comment below. Don't forget to click like and subscribe my channel. See you. Bye. The Antonio Project.